Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the US 27 Maintenance Resurfacing Public Meeting. My name is Will Ezidot, and I'm the project manager with the Florida Department of Transportation. During the meeting, we will explain the department's plans to repair the segment of US 27 to maintain a safe and reliable driving surface. We encourage your feedback, and there are many ways you can submit your questions and comments. All written comments are part of the public meeting record and will be responded in writing. I will now turn it over to our project team to begin the presentation. Meeting information is being provided in multiple ways to allow the community to receive information about the project and provide input. This meeting is being conducted in person and virtually through GoToWebinar. The presentation is also available on the project webpage at www.cflroads.com forward slash project forward slash 450-637-1. That's www.cflroads.com forward slash project forward slash 450-637-1. This public meeting was advertised and is being conducted in accordance with state and federal requirements, including Title VI of the Civil Rights Act of 1964. Public participation is solicited without regard to race, color, national origin, age, sex, religion, disability, or family status. Persons wishing to express their concerns about Title VI may do so by contacting Melissa McKinney, District 5 Title VI Coordinator, by mail at 719 South Woodland Boulevard, mail station 501, Deland, Florida 32720, by phone at 386-943-5077, or email melissa.mckinney at dot.state.fl.us. That's M-E-L-I-S-S-A dot M-C-K-I-N-N-E-Y at dot.state.fl.us. You may also contact Stefan Kulikowski, State Title VI Coordinator, by mail at 605 Sewanee Street, Mail Station 65, Tallahassee, Florida 32399-0450, by phone at 850-414-4742, or email at stefan.kulikowski at dot.state.fl.us. That's S-T-E-F-A-N dot K-U-L-A-K-O-W-S-K-I at D-O-T dot S-T-A-T-E dot F-L dot U-S. This information is shown on a sign at the in-person location on the project website and in the meeting notifications. The purpose of tonight's meeting is to explain the project goals, present the department's recommended improvements to help achieve those goals, and hear from the community about the proposed changes. This project runs 8.2 miles along US 27, also known as US 441, from north of Southeast 178th Place to south of Southeast 62nd Avenue in Marion County. This is a maintenance resurfacing project which will mill and resurface the roadway to maintain a safe riding surface. Currently, from north of Southeast 178th Place to north of Southeast Highway 25A, US 27 is a four-lane highway divided by a 40-foot-wide grassy median. There are two 12-foot-wide lanes in each direction with four-foot-wide paved outside shoulders. This project will resurface this area. There are no other changes. Currently, from north of Southeast Highway 25A to south of Southeast 62nd Avenue, US 27 is a four-lane highway divided by a grassy 20-foot-wide median. There are two 12-foot wide travel lanes in each direction. The paved outside shoulders are nine feet wide with curb and gutter. Other than resurfacing, there are no changes to this corridor. Design is underway on this project and is anticipated to be complete in early 2026 at an estimated cost of $1.1 million. All work will be done within the existing right-of-way. 
Construction is anticipated to start in summer 2026 at an estimated cost of $17.5 million. We encourage your input and feedback about this project and there are multiple ways for you to participate. All public comments and questions are part of the public meeting record and every method for providing public comments and questions carries equal weight. While comments and questions will be accepted at any time, those submitted by August 26, 12 days after the public meeting, will become part of the project's public meeting record. All written comments and questions will be responded to in writing. In-person attendees are encouraged to speak with project team members to ask questions and provide input. To submit a comment for the public meeting record, please complete a printed comment form and return it to project staff. Written comments may also be submitted on the project website at www.cflroads.com forward slash project forward slash 450-637-1. You may also contact FDOT Project Manager Will Isidort directly by email at will.isidort at dot.state.fl.us. That's W-I-L-L dot I-S-I-D-O-R-T at D-O-T dot S-T-A-T-E dot F-L dot U-S. Or by U.S. mail at the Florida Department of Transportation, 719 South Woodland Boulevard, Mail Station 542, DeLand, Florida, 32720. You may also call Mr. Isidort at 386-943-5415 to provide verbal comments during normal business hours. The contact information is also available on the public meeting notifications that you may have received by mail. To learn more about this project, go to www.cflroads.com. Type the project number 450-637-1 in the search box at the top right and click Go. Then click on the project name. Public meeting materials are posted on the website now. On behalf of the Florida Department of Transportation, thank you for attending this public meeting and providing your input on this project. If you have comments or questions after the meeting, please submit them by August 26, 2024. Have a good evening.